Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of me playing Monster Harvest. And in the last episode we've got the second batch out of four from the Rec Center competition in order to ultimately fight our foe Rayleigh. And we've also unlocked the area to the east of the town. And in this episode, if I get the money back in from my lovely, lovely farm, <laughs> I will be able to unblock the side to the west in order to get a fishing rod. So we'll see if that happens. And also, as always, the big question is, what is the livestock situation gonna be? <laughs> because I had one little baby livestock thingy thing, and now it multiplied somehow into four, two of which we can't see, and it's kind of confusing. So we'll see what happens. Let's go. Hello. Hello, 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 and it is raining, which it didn't do in the last episode when I had the exact same day. But okay, let's get these pickled goods. Amazing. I don't know why I got four out of that, but okay, we've got two pickled torch peppers. Ah, is that the hybrid ones? And one pickled screenberry and one pickled radberry. Okay all worth $90 each. Absolutely amazing. And I think we can harvest these lovelies here. All the stuff, look at me. Ooh. <laughs> okay, so as you can see, we clearly need more seeds today, but I will go to the dungeon later and deal with that. Sell, 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 sell. Okay, so livestock situation, what's it gonna be? Okay, <laughs> they actually multiplied, but they're still babies. So here you can see that they look like adult mulberries, but they're clearly still babies. But uh, they multiplied anyway. Amazing. So maybe I should get, I think it was the blue seeds that make livestock out of it. So I could blue slimify the seeds here. Okay, I shall get blue slimes. I should also probably bring a red slime for Thorn to increase the friendship and someday get some discounts. That would be cool. Let's go. Okay, there you go. Hehe, <laughs> thanks. You are welcome. And yes, blue slime uh, creates livestock out of it. So let's go get two of them. And I shall go here now to get some more forageable goods. Oh, hi, Ash. Anything new? You got out exploring with that kind of gear? You look like you need an upgrade or some more planimals to protect you. Um, do I not have enough planimals? Um, okay, well, at least it's something new that he's saying and not the same old thing about the, about the pickler. Okay, so we've got three blue fruit, one smoom flower, Four dragon flowers, two blue slimes that we bought, okay. <laughs> one morning glory, three lemons, two green slimes, and one ban apple. Amazing, let's go back home. Okay, so I found another dragon flower on the way. Let's just sell everything except for the slimes, of course. Coolio. Right, let's see, what did we slimify into the livestock here? The screamberry. So this plant is what we are not going to slimify with the blue slime. So instead, here's a blue slime. Ah, I don't have enough space. That is correct. But I thought that this info maybe would have come uh, if we would have been ready to harvest the livestock. But uh, okay, let's sell three of them, which worked. Okay. <laughs> and blue slime and blue slime. Okay, this should be should be correct i hope let's use the green slime just so we can see the livestock straight away okay hello there okay what that that noise and okay a gopper and a radurki we'll see if you ever grow up <laughs> okay and now it's time for evening for dungeon time and i will actually um kind of i think use up this one just so i get more hearts for the soil level i think the weakest ones will have to go anyway and i'm gonna keep 
Mega Scream Bat and Glowfin. I will protect them from being KO'd in the fight. <laughs> but also, now that I sold all the stuff, I will unlock this here. Can I... Can I do that at night time? Unblock Calming Cove for $1,500. Yes. Eratosaur. Let's go. Let's check this out. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Amazing. So more area to get forageable goods. And here we are. Wow, thanks for clearing away that rubble. Hydra and I live out here and we're having trouble getting back and forth to town. I heard you're pretty handy on that farm and with planimals. We're not too interested in planimals. What are we interested in? Why, fishing, of course. You don't know how to fish? Well, here, I have a spare rod you can have to get you started. It's the least we do to repay you. All you have to do is cast that into any body of water to start. If you get a nibble, be sure to reel it in as fast as you can by hitting the interact button repeatedly. Okay. <laughs> if you like fishing, I can sell you some better fishing rods, but you'll need some raw materials as well. Give it a try. It's a lot of fun and fish can be sold for a profit as well. Bye! Hey, bye. Cool. They're actually gone. Okay, give me that. So it goes up until here. Eh. Let's try fishing real. Ooh. Eh. Yeeha! Glitch. Glitch perfect. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm getting a headache. Uh, let's use the fishing rod and try and hit that green there. Ooh, we got it. Ooh. Got him. If you know what I mean. No. Okay. Abort. <laughs> okay, so I just got a squid, a small nocturnal fish that can be found west of Planimal Point, and a large fish that can be found west of Planimal Point, Tuna. Takes away a little bit of energy, of course. We can't enter here at night, okay. Some nice source of income if needed. And whenever the farm is automated, to the cave. Okay, so just as a quick reminder, the aim now is to get seeds for the farm. The Mega Scream Bat and the Glowfin, they can gladly stay with me and the rest can go if um, if they happen to not make it. <laughs> and of course I'm also going to try and get titanium, but you can only get titanium from level 2 of the dungeons. Okay, so we just won over the level 1 guarding uh, planimal. The chompy and let's get all these seeds, greenberry seeds. And level two. Level ten rat hog. Okay. Let's get some titanium here. Okay, so I'm out of stamina and I'm not going to use the fish that I got to get some extra stamina. So we've got um 19 titanium so far. So now it's really just getting more seeds by getting higher levels in the mine. Okay, so we found the guard of the next level. Let's do this. Come here. Okay, for ripple. Poison first and then just standard attack from Radhog, which is now already level 11. So piece of a cake. Amazing. All the stuff, please. Cool, cool, cool. Those were the ratberry seeds and we're in level three. Okay, our rat hog just donated 11 hearts. So jelly puppy is up next. Okay, about to level, not bad. Okay, and the dark slime is the guard of level three. Should be easy enough. Jelly puppy is level 10 and now already. There we go. Thank you very much, jelly puppy. You did very well and level 11. Yay! And all the stuff. Right, and those were crab apple seeds. All the free seeds, amazing. And we're in level four. Okay, and that was Jala Poppy. <laughs> now we're down to Scream Bat. Let's do this. Scream Bat against Scream Bat, and it worked. Jala Poppy was level 12 when it just donated its heart points. To us very generous and the guard of level four let's see if scream bat can deal with a uh, fire snake here let's uh, okay i wanted to poison first 
clearly missed that opportunity and it doesn't look too good for our screen bat here because fire snake is level 21 <laughs> and poisoned as well so it worked okay screen bat is level 12 and replenished amazing okay give me all the stuff yay another nine crab apple seeds so now we have 18 of those let's go to level five here we are okay and the chest of level five we completed the dungeons again and nine more crab apple seeds and also titanium amazing hello radosaur let's go home Okay, so we've got in total 27 crab apple seeds, 11 radberry seeds, 31 titanium, 12 screenberry seeds, 4 bonions, 5 yam yams, the squid and the tuna from earlier, 3 glow shrooms, 2 morning glory still, and 1 smooth flower, and 3 torch pepper seeds. Okay, I'm just going to sell the forageable goods and also the fishies. For monies there we go and let's make some pipe elements as many as we can I mean I still have two titaniums in my chest but uh, that's okay we have 15 pipe elements now more than enough let's just um, go this way I guess cool this is kind of random obviously so I'm going to change that eventually let's just put seats wherever we can Okay, I can't use that corner for some reason and I can't use in between here for some reason. Yeah, this, this cor corner worked and this one works and here works and bam, bam and bam. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, we still have uh, 18 crab apple seeds left. We can put them down tomorrow whenever we have our stamina regained, replenished. Let's go to the next day. And we've got $2,810. Okay, so pickled stuff is good. As you can see, farming did a good job. Foraging also very, very good. Okay, not bad. Wow, coolie, yo. Amazing. And one thing that I already noticed here is today is some type of festival and it didn't come up as a text so maybe we're doomed <laughs> maybe today is already ruined let's harvest Ooh, satisfying three more seeds bam 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 okay and i'm going to sell everything because i still have enough fruits here for the pickler there we go okay and uh let's see what the livestock situation is like it looks kind of normal it looks normal, guys. Wow. Okay, well, we'll see how much longer it will be normal for. Let's check out the town, get some forageable stuff and see what the festival thing is like. If we can go there now already or what the deal is. Okay, so we got festival, festival balloons here, so that's good. Can we give thorn stuff? No, it's all closed. Okay, so foraging it is. Okay, hi, bird. Okay, so I just foraged everything I could. So I got five red slimes, four morning glories, four blue fruits, three dragon flowers, four lemons, five smoom flowers, two ban apples, and one green slime. And up there you can see that I have 34 heart elements, I forgot the actual term, <laughs> left uh, to spend on my soil level. I will do that later. Now, however, I will go and check out the festival grounds. Let's see what is happening here. What's up, party people? No sales thingy thing. I don't even know what the festival is called. <laughs> hey Shuki, not everything around here revolves around planimals. Fishing is a great pastime too. Yes. Like, I've never fished before, but how hard can it be? Now which part of the rod is the hook? <laughs> Finally, a festival I can get behind. Okay. And Misty, 
uh, Joy, sorry, uh, Misty's up there, I think. I'll be excited just to catch anything. Same. <laughs> sure, I've been fishing most of my life. I can't wait to see what I catch today. And Lance, I've been practicing. I think I can catch a big one. Good for you. And Misty, fishing takes a lot of patience. I don't know if I have it. Vex loves fishing. I think she'll win the contest for sure. And I think there's something in the water here that seems to make the fish bite extra well. So this is a competition. How do I join the competition? Hello, Ash. Um, okay, seats, statues, paintings, folding chairs, and just the same, same. How do I participate? Um, like, it seems like I would want to participate. Uh, Dot, haven't spoken to you yet. I think I like planimals a lot better than fish, but Jet really wanted to come out today. Okay, so... Sparky boy? Hey, Shuki, not everything... Okay, just the same. What happens if I catch a fish now? Will it trigger something? Some event? Ugh. Hey, a stone. That's uh, not gonna be of any good. Eh. An actual fish? Urgh. Another actual fish. And because we can't go to the dungeon today because of the festival, I'll just use my energy on the fishing. Why not? See what happens. I'm getting muscles over here. <laughs> I'll be so fit after this. And... Okay, I'm out of stamina. Ooh. So we got five rocks. Wow. Three trout, uh, one pike and two catfish. So now what do I do now? It's just the same. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to interact with this whole thing here. Maybe it's just that um, boost that uh, the doctor here is talking about, Dr. Marshall, uh, that there's something in the water here that makes the fish bite extra well. Might be a hint. <laughs> okay, well, it was a fantastic uh, festival. Um, was great to see you again. Uh, excuse me? Okay, uh, bye. Okay, so... That, uh, I guess, was the fest festival. I will sell everything except f the fish. And then I will check into the evening. Maybe maybe we can participate in the evening. But uh, my gut feeling is telling me, no, no, evening, there will not be a festival anymore. So guess we'll see. And evening, please. Thank you. Okay, Radosaur. This mailbox, by the way, I never get mail. Nobody likes me. Okay, so the balloons are gone. That's always a great sign. Rufus, what do you have to say? Isn't it past your bedtime? That again. What is here? I mean, I tried to enter before, but I just can't. Unfortunately. Okay, okay, okay. This, oh, this is giving me a headache. Let's just use the mouse. It's a bit nicer like that. Okay, nothing new, basically. So let me guess, the festival's over. It is so over. And I will just check if I can enter the dungeon. But uh, usually that's not an option on a day of a festival, obviously. So, yeah. Sorry, Shuki, dungeon is closed during festivals. Go and celebrate. There's nothing to celebrate, but I'll go anyway. Anyway. Anyway, okay, well, that was fun, guys, wasn't it? Let's sell the fishies. Sell, sell, and eh, sell. Should be some good income the next day, though. We shall see. And uh, yes, I would love to sleep. 1955, and it's clearly raining, as you can hear, thunderstorm even. All right, everybody, thank you so much for watching this episode. Uh, we'll see what happens in the next one. I'm sure I'll be able to further work on the farm layout and its productivity and efficiency. That would be fantastic. And also we'll see if the livestock, <laughs> uh, what happens with them. Like, I just don't have any expectations anymore. Just question marks. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks again for watching. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to this channel. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.